I'm Gabrielle Khaleesi in the WUFT Newsroom. For Tuesday, June 7th, here's your News in 90. While residents along Florida's Gulf Coast may not have had much to worry about from Tropical Storm Colin, it was a different story for fishermen. Red snapper season lasts only nine days. Fishermen say the tropical storm has cost them a third of their fishing time. While they didn't expect the storm to completely devastate them, some fishermen say they wish the season could be extended an extra three days. NBC and other networks have declared Hillary Clinton the presumptive Democratic nominee and the first woman to win enough delegates to represent a major party in the race for president. California and five other states vote today. Bernie Sanders insists it's not a done deal. He says some delegates haven't voted yet, and he still has a shot at the nomination by winning California. A woman in Hawaii is charged with second-degree murder after she intentionally crashed a car, killing her twin sister. Alexandria Duval pleaded not guilty in a Maui court Monday. Police say Duval drove an SUV off a cliff on purpose, and witnesses said the two sisters were arguing. Documents show the driver didn't attempt to brake before the crash. Secretary of State John Kerry expressed concerns today about Beijing's new law regulating the activities of foreign non-government organizations in China. China's legislative body passed the new law in late April, subjecting foreign non-profits to close police supervision. Kerry said the organizations need to be free to enhance relations between the countries. But the Chinese vice premier said the regulation is only aimed at improving the playing field for civil society. That's your News in 90. Thanks for watching.